Katie Hellman reporting for TTN HD Production Live here at the 10th annual Female Eye Film Festival in Toronto with Beatrice Uste from Mystico Fantastico. What was the best part about making this film? Um, I think the best part was living on a beach for 30 days <laughs> <Not> <laughs> with local tacos with the woman who would make us tacos every day. That part was really good. Mm. Um, and just frolicking on the beach was fantastic and all the people that we met, of course. The whole town came out to meet us. So, Tell me a little bit about your character. Uh, my character is Louise. Um, Louise is washed up on the shores of this little Mexican town and she doesn't know where she is or where she comes from so in the film she has to figure out all of those things but she also figures out that her life isn't as interesting and important as she maybe thought it was or that maybe she was in denial that her her uh, job at home they were missing her and it was so important um, and that maybe she should stop and smell the roses I think <laughs> that's what she learns. <laughs> was it easy for you to relate to the character? Uh, I don't know, I don't take myself so seriously, so no. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think sometimes, certainly sometimes there are crossroads in your life where you decide to make, you make decisions that will change the course of your, I guess your, your future basically. So yes, in that case, yes, <laughs> definitely. What is your acting process like? How do you get into character? Uh, I do it in a very naturalistic way, I think. Um, I definitely think about the character, but I'm an actor that works moment to moment. Mm -hmm. um, and so beforehand, I figure out who this woman is, where she comes from, what she wants. Obviously, I figure out what her motivation is. But all of that depends on circumstance, what, what's happening in the moment. And yeah. with this film uh, in particular, I was really lucky because the director actually let me improvise, which, oh. which was fantastic. So um, there, I think the process just becomes more natural when you're allowed to, you know, do whatever you feel comes, you know, and, and that's how I work best anyway. And is most of the film improvised? Like what percentages? Oh, percentage? Uh, no, I, I would say that there was a script, we had a script, um, but then as we were on the beach meeting people and finding really beautiful things, we thought that scenes could change and th we sort of, <laughs> I guess you could say that the plan, we had a plan, we had a script, and then we just sort of improvised a little bit throughout the script. Right. Yeah. Cool. yeah. And where is the best place to find out more information on the film and on you as well online? Oh, uh, boy, I don't, we have a Facebook page for Mystico Fantastico. Um, and I also have a website that's at uh, BeatriceUstay.com. <laughs> oh no, dot uh, workbooklive.com. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, but Anita would have more details on where to find the film, more info. Well, thank you very much and best of luck with the film and all of your upcoming projects. Oh, thank you. I really appreciate it. Thanks. I'm Katie Allman reporting for TTNHD Production Live here at the Female Eye Film Festival in Toronto. Check it out at www.femaleeyefilmfestival.com.